Hi there guys, my name is George and today I want to show you how the game The Witcher Tay Wild Hunt runs on the system that is far below the minimum requirements uh, set by the developers for this game. So in order to make this game run on the uh, requirements that are below, I had to go into the ini files and uh, edit some uh, settings there like a uh, number of foliage and uh, is generated and uh, reduce the quality of the textures but uh, let's see how the game looks now and uh, how it performs so the specifications of this system will be posted in the description below and uh, also I will post all the edits I made so in the in settings so I hope you guys will find that useful and you can also use the TV files to edit your uh, graphics to a, a level that is uh, higher than Ultra which will make your game look uh, even better if you have a beefy enough computer but uh, I want to let you know guys that uh, this will require you to have a very very fast and good computer in order to make this happen but uh, yeah if that's something that you prefer we will go anyway i am going to skip this uh movie here movie performs pretty well and we will go straight to the cast scene the first one to see how the game performs here So as you can see, graphics is obviously slightly downgraded by the things that I did, but uh, it's still uh, good enough to be enjoyable and playable, I would say. Still looks pretty decent, we still have all the flashings and stuff. Uh, we have a slight FPS drop when the camera is moving, I guess. But uh, I have to remind you guys that it's only in cut seats when the actual games gameplay comes into action. Uh, if Vietnamese drops are pretty manageable, I would say. But we will see that in a bit. It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday. Okay, I guess we have to skip this and uh, go straight into the gameplay. So yeah, this is a, a good way for you guys that uh, don't have strong enough PCs to run your game. You'll be able to still run it even if your PC is far below the minimum requirements. You just have to be careful what you edit and uh, how you go about it. So that's why I will post my edits in the description below where you can find them and uh, use them to edit your file yourself. You're running out of juice. I know. You might bring me some more once you're done training. Okay guys, I will skip this uh, training stage of the game and uh, I will go straight into the open area world where you can see how the game actually performs while we were playing the game. So I will see you soon. Okay guys, we are back and now we are in the open world area. So let's uh, skip through these classes real right. quick and uh, see how well, the game performs. Dog. Started. Yeah. Was she not? Hmm. Trudel. We'll find her. And the dream. Oh. Didn't end? No. It was just a... Be done. Wait. Didn't have stop. You were good. Um, what's this post? That's private. Uh -huh. Back on. 
Two or three days. Wait, I hear it. Okay, now let's see the combat uh, aspect. Let's see how the game performs actually when we are in the world fighting and stuff. There is a slight uh, FPS drop, but uh, nothing major. I guess I could have decreased uh, the level of full age a bit more and uh, gain a bit more FPS from that, but uh, I wanted to keep the game uh, as uh, humanly possible to be good looking, I guess, but uh, still be able to run it. So I didn't want to go far below this and the uh, black of trees and stuff that would look pretty bad. As you can see, we still have pretty decent amount of foliage, gas, and all that stuff, so not major. There is, of course, of course, a slight delay in combat, but. Uh, Nothing we can't handle, so uh, this is an option for you if you have a computer that is below your requirements and uh, you will still be able to run it by using these uh, settings. Let's run around a bit and uh, see how the game performs while we are running. Pretty decent, I would say. And now let's try the horse, that should give us a bit more speed, so we can uh, test it a bit better, I guess. Run, Roach. Ever tell you about this sorcerer I knew? Couldn't stop talking about how useful... So yeah, guys, like you can see, there are still some trees there left. I didn't want to remove all of them. You can brew potions from their blood. Still pretty decent looking for the <laughs> no, because by eating level of detail that the we dynamics. are going for. Yes. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living? But yeah, like I said before, same way, like I reduced the settings and no. uh, Remove the foliage at the uh, same way you can add foliage to the game and uh, make it a bit better, more, more vibrant and stuff. If you want, if you have uh, enough PC. But uh, that will depend on your PC alone, so you will have to play with that yourself. So, yeah, guys, uh, that's pretty much it. If you would like the file. Any file that I used uh, to edit, you guys can uh, let me know in the comment section below and I will save, send you the file to your YouTube uh, inbox or your personal mail, whichever you prefer. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Also guys, if you, if you would like to see gameplay of uh, this type of uh, settings, and uh, all that uh, I will make it. Just let me know in the comment section below. But uh, so far, since my Slow now. game is, uh, since my PC is not uh, good enough to run the game on the highest settings, or even medium for that matter, or even low for that matter, I won't be making a gameplay of that, but uh, like I said, if you guys would like me to go below the minimum requirements and uh, show you the game, how it looks a bit more, what Whoa. we are actually playing, making let's play of, I will make that and uh, yeah, just let me know and uh, that's it. So yeah guys, I hope you like this. Like I said, uh, everything will be in the description below. My uh, system settings, uh, my configuration uh, and uh, the lines I used uh, to edit in any file. So 
keep an eye out for that and uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time.